Well, she didn't make it very far. Ico, I think that's how you'd say it. Ico, or oh, whatever. Two characters had to get married in the last episode, but uh, it wasn't quite like Zidane took it way more seriously than Dagger did. From his perspective, like, oh crap, I don't want to get married. Then once it finally happens, like, oh okay, I'm I'm married to this girl now. Uh, from from Dagger's perspective, it was just something that they had to do in order to sneak through the village. So, I mean, there's that. Then we encountered this little girl who, along with a Moogle, was stealing food from Conte Petty. I think that would be another way to pronounce it. And, well, she seems like she lives like a little bit of a recluse off in an area where all those Rally Ho freaks were... Fire! All those other freaks were um, hiding and uh, living in that village, and none of them really are allowed, due to some sort of a tradition, from heading further or deeper into this environment. So pretty much, she seems like she was living off on her own, along with that Moogle. This Eco girl, she is um, you know, a bit of an uh, interesting case. I mean, look at what we got here. She has, to a certain extent, the same kind of abilities that Dagger does. She's a white mage, she can cure low physical attack power, but she can summon. Look at this. It seemed like a rather unusual ability that Dagger had, that she could go and summon these monsters and all that kind of stuff, but no, no, she's not the only person who has the ability to do that. Nico also has a... Um, rather distinct feature of her own. She has a horn on her head. Now, we haven't really been able to get a good view of that because the character models are so small and all that kind of crap. 
but she has a horn on her head. Uh, couldn't really see it there. Those ears, I think, are just like a... Yeah, see, there you go. You see the, the horn on her head there. She has these fake ears on her head, I think. They're fake, anyway. <laughs> What? Barely got five steps. There is a little bit of a weird setup we also have going when it comes to the collection of characters that we have right now. Oh, oh, look who it is. Um, okay. Finally get to give one of these letters. Let me save real quick. Boom! Oops! Since she can summon, let's, regardless of what we're fighting here, let's get into the fight and let Pico summon something. Gotta love the references to the Thor mythology and all that. How do I, how do I get rid of the hub? Awesome. Kill them now! Well, isn't that something? Now, um, it wasn't it wasn't apparent to them that she had the capability of summoning an idolin, but what do we have here? It wasn't apparent to them that she had the ability to summon these things, and she obviously didn't just volunteer that information upon meeting them. But during battle, when it does summon them, even though it didn't actually kill the enemies, just hurt them, they are like, holy crap, she can do this too. Wow, look at that. That's a big tree there. We're running around on top of its roots and everything. Oh, boss battle. Didn't even get a chance to see it. Ow, oh, you are cheating us now. Come on. Look at that freak. Oh. Is he made out of grass or something? <laughs> let's, uh, let's get everybody cured up here at the start of this battle. Oh, we actually got something. Very nice. 
Now, like usual, in a boss battle, I'm going to try to steal things right at the beginning. Fortunately, well, like, I kind of got lucky with that first attempt because I stole something on the first try, but as noted many a times earlier, that that is rather unusual. Oh, and I got a Phoenix Hen. Okay. Each boss usually only has two items, so I can get back to my killing right away. That was nice. Judgment Bolt! Notice it's an abbreviated version of the summons. Something that they actually got quite a bit of complaint out of in the earlier games, I'm talking 7 and 8, was that the summon abilities tended to have large, elaborate animations that looked pretty awesome, but I haven't seen them a half a dozen times. I mean, you're, you're done watching. So you want to just keep, uh, go on and not, uh, and not bother with this crap anymore. So this game goes and they fortunately go and uh, abbreviate these things like that. So the summon animation doesn't take very long to get through. <laughs> this thing's got to be fairly close to its death. Eco has a has regen cast on her, so she will eventually cure the damage she's taken. But you know, can't uh, trust it. Regen's gonna do it fast enough. She's also burned through most of her stash of MP, so her attack power and her usefulness in this fight is gonna be fairly limited going forward. So I'm gonna throw an ether at her. Oh, it's curing itself. Much rather have actually had Quinna in this fight instead of Rico, because it would have been able to do some significant physical attacks. Cause Dagger is, I mean, having two white mages in one party is kind of, in a sense, pointless, because, you know, one can do it. Dagger has a large enough mana pool that she can keep all the characters alive and kicking long enough. Eco's become just sort of a burden on the party because she's burned through her MP pool pretty fast and can't continue to summon or anything like that. So, I mean, it's unfortunate. 70 HP is not enough to really just... I should just let her get knocked out. It's got an anchor tied to its arm. <laughs> Counter-attack! Ha, <laughs> 777. Is it dead? Yep. I love the animations of things dying in this game. Well, now it's dead. Direction to go here. Take all these stones. They're all mine.
Uh, check it out, it's an Ocho. Oh, Vivi's almost out of magic. Oh no, it's... Uh, let's not screw around. Let's steal this thing as much damage as we can as quickly as possible. And try to take it out. Ocho is usually a pretty powerful enemy. It's difficult to defeat. The uh, graphics for this thing look so much better than the version Final Fantasy VII did. Although I did kind of like the look of the version in eight. Gonna burn through all your MP doing a um, judgment bolt here. I gotta be careful. It's a plant, so probably. Oh, look, it's the full animation. It will do the full animation every now and then. Ooh, nice damage there, dagger. Oh, oh I got it. Nice. 